I'm trying to slay 2019, okay? I really love these glasses. You guys always ask about where I buy these, and these are from Rainbow. Rainbow is the plug, okay? They've always been. is taste pink happy new year i hope you guys brought in the new year with a bang however you spent it whether you were in church you were at the club or you were just among friends or even by yourself it's time to make the most of 2019 because sis it's time to get to it so i wanted to start off 2019 with a gorgeous synthetic wig and this is a 20 dollar wig that i purchased from wig types and this is the sensational empress lace front edge wig in the boutique deep style and i got this in a number two now if you're anything like me i love looking at cheaper units because you know after i wear them once they get a little bit more worn they transition into workout wigs so you guys if you follow me on instagram make sure you're following me sis that's something that i really like to do because you really get the full use of your unit but to jump into this style you guys can see that the interior cap construction sensational has really good interior cap constructions and it has a more comfortable fit and you guys can see this has a very long length to the parting space and you get two combs on the left and right sides along with additional comb and adjustable straps at the nape this has a softer swiss lace and the first thing that i noticed though the parting space is super super tight and it does not look realistic i will say from what they have on the stock card to what you actually get it's very different so you're gonna have to do a considerable amount of plucking so the first thing i did i went in with my tweezers the rat tail comb and made sure to clip the sides of the unit down as i begin to remove you know strategic hairs with my fingers i do not recommend using tweezers to remove the hair because this lace is super soft and i did kind of nick or puncture the lace just the slightest bit it's not noticeable but it's super easy to kind of puncture it so definitely be careful and i will say I, as soon as I put this unit on to the canvas blockhead, I noticed that it was tight. My canvas blockhead is 23 and a half inches circumference, so this is not big head friendly just as a sidebar now to get back into the tweezing i had to tweeze an incredible amount of hair like you guys can see from the before and after your girl had to put in a lot of work and i removed a lot of hair like look at this sis i took a lot of hair out once you finish tweezing the parting space and everything looks good, I went in to mist the hair with water and a little bit of dry shampoo. And I do that to help kind of pull and move the shed hair from the parting space that I may not have removed with my own hand just to move it down the length of the hair. And also, even though this has a very natural texture, which they definitely mastered it perfectly, I just like to do that to remove any excess shine and so it looks as natural as possible. This is the perfect virgin hair dupe it's super light on the pockets but you get that virgin hair feel which a girl is kind of in love with this has a really good volume a really good density I will say there's no hump at the top where the parting space is you know how curly units they typically do that no sensational got it right but in the back like you know once you get past the crown I wish it were a little bit fuller but this unit is super long you guys can see this extends far far beyond my bust line and it's probably probably past the start of my waist so if you're tall you can slay this or if you're someone that's a little bit shorter or average height if you're feeling bold definitely pick this up but if you are intending to wear a unit like this i highly recommend a braided base because if you want to do the little struggle plaits it may not work if i mean if you have a larger head that is so i had to wear the wig grip with my unit and that makes a ton of a difference so it doesn't slide back it's not so much about like keeping it in place but you want a more comfortable fit and so the wig grip really just helps you know with it staying put and making it a more comfortable fit i have the wig grip linked in the description box if you guys are interested now as far as laying the baby hairs because like again the stock car is giving like gorgeous tees but that's not what you're gonna get you're gonna have to put in a little bit of work 
so i recommend two options if you're a beginner and you have you know a full enough hairline you can go in and like lay down your own natural baby hairs with a little bit of gel or mousse and then you know just kind of plop the wig just behind your natural hairline if you're someone like me if you have the time and the patience sis, because i don't want to make it seem like it's easy take your spoolie i use a sephora brand spoolie and you want to kind of like pull the hair or like pin it backwards and you just want to gently brush down a few baby hairs you want to either like trim them if they're a little too long and then just lay them with mousse or again you can use the got to be glam for sculpting gel which is one of my favorites and that's what I did for this particular unit and I definitely feel like I didn't overdo it like I usually be doing I'm trying to get myself together this year but I love how this unit turned out I definitely you know did a little trick because you know when you have a three-part wig sometimes like the front it just it gets really flimsy so I just sprayed a little bit of holding spray I used the got to be free spray and I just like pulled the hair back and you want to spray it and pin it and let it set for about like you know 10 15 minutes honestly the longer the better and it lays perfectly i'm not you know fumbling with my hair i feel like this you know flow is kind of perfect now i did go in and layer the ends just a little bit they did a really good job with the layers so i feel like as i went down the length i just had to you know go in and polish it up a bit but it's gorgeous you definitely have three-way parting with this but the thing is you have to shift it so i like that sensational wasn't trying to sell the girls a dream like oh you know you have three individual parts no you have to go in and shift the part and i try to do the parting space laying it in different areas on the left and the right in the middle but you guys know i love a right side part so i can have like the bang kind of flow over on my left side be sure to subscribe give this video a thumbs up if you're feeling a look and would you purchase it for yourself mm -hmm. and kiki with me in the comments so sis go ahead and check the description box i'm gonna link where you can purchase this from the online stores wherever or check the beauty supply store because they may have it for cheaper sis you never know i'm trying to slay 2019 okay I really love these glasses you guys always ask about where i buy these and these are from rainbow rainbow is the plug okay they've always been i feel like i'm giving salt and pepper kind of like that 80 90s kind of feel with the bamboo earrings and the vertical stripe shirt mm -hmm. i got this shirt from charlotte Russe, if you guys are wondering but thank you so much for watching and i hope i see you in the next one